right, new game. Um, amateur. Because uh, we're amateurs. Ooh. 60 years ago, a violent sandstorm uncovered an ancient tomb in the desert outside Cairo. Violent sandstorm. Ooh. A British expedition set off in hope of finally finding Egypt's legendary lost queen. Ooh. Okay. Lost queen. The expedition never returned. The explorers were lost, presumed dead. For 60 years, the grisly tale of the cursed team remained the only proof of the tomb's existence. <laughs> Dang! Okay. She won't be lost anymore. Present day. 100 kilometers outside of Cairo, Kingston University. A lot, actually. The crew left after the storm. They kept talking about the old team that disappeared, and then they were gone. Oh, who cares? I'm just glad you're okay. About that... What? The docs here say it is a reason to believe I was attacked. Nancy, you're the only oh, one Oh, he was attacked. That now. makes more I sense. Hi, John! My eyes and ears until I can get out of here. But I just came here to job shadow you. Are you sure? I Will you be coming back? Job shadow you. As soon as they release me. Until then, keep me updated on what you're seeing. I've got some notes in my bunk area. Get caught up to speed. Keep Get everything you find speed. between you and me. The less you seem to know, the safer you'll be. Got it. I'll see if I can prove whose tomb this is and find out who attacked you. I think I need to turn it down a little bit. It's a little loud, right, chat? Um, have you ever heard of a mystery crime solving game called the Payne's Creek Killings? I have not. What is that? <laughs> the music is such a <laughs> merrier vibe. It's like, oh, you got hit. Oh. <laughs> I'll let you go. Bye. All right. Let's turn it. It's locked. It's locked. It's, it's locked. locked. It's locked. There. Hopefully, does that sound better? I feel like that's better. <laughs> She's not talking right now, though. Ooh, look at our tent. All right. Nice, nice. Oh, here's our tasks. Cool. I like the menu bar. This looks interesting. Um. All right. Let's. What's this? I bet someone would play this game with me. Yeah. Who'd I play it? I bet someone would play this game with me. What's in here? All right, let's snoop. Who is that? Who are these real people? Who are you? Great. I could use this to translate the hieroglyphs. Oh, okay. Nice. How to read Egyptian hieroglyphs. We're going to be reading Egyptian hieroglyphs, guys. All right, the bird is a... Ah. I don't know what this means. Trends... Um, Egyptian hieroglyphs are one of the oldest writing systems dating back to 3000 BC. Means sacred inscriptions in Greek were used mainly for inscriptions in temples and tombs. There are three basic groups of signs. Phonograms, ideograms, and determinatives. Okay, phonograms are sound signs or signs that represent a sound like the letters in the English alphabet. Unlike our modern alphabet, an individual phonogram could also represent two or three sounds. Single sound signs are known as uniliterals. Two sound signs are pre per, per a, pre are bilateral, such as per, oh per p r are bilateral, and three sounds such as w s r are trilateral. Okay, ideograms are sense. Signs represent the actual object depicted. They were generally drawn with a single stroke sign between them or beneath them. 
indicating that they were to be read as an ideogram and not a phonogram. Oh, okay. So if it's a thing that has a line underneath, a single stroke underneath, then that's an ideogram. Determinatives or labeling signs are ideograms that appear at the end of a word to give an indication of its general meaning. The hieroglyph depicting two feet in, is frequently seen as a determinative to indicate moving or walking. Movement or walking. Interesting. Oh god, there's more. Well, we'll look at this when we need to remember. Mm, food. Chocolate. Too many big words. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Um... Also, no, it's not fine. I need to fix this one more second. Sorry, 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 sorry. There we go. We're learning again. <laughs> We're learning about hieroglyphs. Woo, go us. All right, is there anything else here? Here's another book. The Lost Queen of Egypt. Professor Beatrice Hotchkiss. It's Hotchkiss. Do y'all remember Hotchkiss? Hotch kisses from one of my favorite Treasure Royal Tower. <laughs> Dear Mandy, you were so keen on my book about Marie Antoinette. I knew you'd enjoy my latest work about these magnificent women. If you'd ever like to learn more, I'd love to talk about them. <gasps> we can call her. We can call her. Was number four. Yeah, I love Treasure to Royal Tower. I love that one. Couscous, that's where I first learned what the heck couscous was. <laughs> I'd like some couscous, dear. Um, oh, these are the different um, women. Okay, we got T.A., Nefertiti, Nefertari, and Cleopatra. The last ruling, I don't think I'm gonna read all of them until we need it, I don't know. The last ruling pharaoh of ancient Egypt was not only a woman, but also one of the most famous names in history, Cleopatra. Born of the Macedonian Ptolemy, what the Ptolemy line, Cleopatra the five, seven was seventeen when she gained the throne. Well known for her intelligence, she was the only this pharaoh to speak Egyptian, Cleopatra did not sit idly by when she was overthrown by her younger brother. Her rise back to power is legendary from smuggling herself into Julius Caesar's presence, wrapped up in a rug to her suicide after Mark Antony's death. Upon her death, her body was to be buried with Mark Antony's. Her tomb has not been conclusively found. Dang. All right, anything else? No. Oh. Oh, no, that's just this. All right, let's keep looking around. So we found a book about the queens. Found a book about hieroglyphics. I love Hotchkiss's voice. I know, I love it too. Um, it doesn't seem like I can go in here. So let's go in the, ooh, here we go. Stay out of there. Oh, okay. Lily. All right, apparently somebody's here. Where? Where? Oh, her. Nancy. Oh. You decided to stay? Of oh, course. She, she saw Good. We need all the help we can get. Look, this is awkward. What's that? Professor Boyle is gone, and I have to say this to keep things from getting awkward, but look, I'm assuming the authority in the time being. Are you sure everyone here agrees to that? I just meant the American team. Which is just you. So she's bossing me around already? I'm not crazy. Uh. Oh, is that her name? Oh my gosh. I'm not crazy. If L Lanny Minella not being the voice of Nancy Moore. Yeah, I think a lot of us were saying the last Nancy Drew game, the voice actress, Brittany Cox, kind of fell really flat. Um and emotionless, expressionless in the voice acting of the last game. But I, I don't know. We were talking about it earlier, which is funny, but um, yeah. I miss this voice actress because she was so, I don't know. Just, even though she was old, um, it still fit somehow. <laughs> sure, I don't mind. Good. 
For now, you can look around if you want. Just don't screw anything up. Trust me. I just don't want the site to fall into chaos. I'm working entirely out of Professor Boyle's playbook. She did it, didn't she? She seems sus. What do you think of her chat? Sus? Or is she normal? She's already wanting to be a boss. A, did she's you already see wanting to boss me to around. Professor Boyle? I couldn't see a thing. I couldn't keep my eyes open for a second. Okay, so for reference, the guy at the beginning that was knocked off on the floor is Professor Boyle, and Nancy Drew came here to shadow him, like his job, job shadowing, but he got knocked out. Sus for sure. I hate her. What? What? <laughs> What's the board game in the middle of the room? Senate. You've got to try it out. Senate. It's one of the first games humans ever played. You've got to try it. The goal is to get all of your pieces off the board first. When a token well, I reaches the last so. square, it's removed from the board. To move, throw the sticks. The number of light sticks determines how many spaces you move. If all four sticks are dark, then you get to move five squares. Did y'all get that? <laughs> Wait, that was a little too fast. Okay, sticks. I threw a two. Well, what does that mean? Okay, here we you go. You can move any of your tokens to either an empty square or a square occupied by your opponent. Can't do that. Can't do that. If you throw a one, four, or five, move a token and then throw the sticks again. If no moves are available, the player skips their turn. I rolled a three, so I'll move my token three spaces. If you land on an opponent, you swap places, sending your opponent's token back to your token starting position. If an opponent has two or more tokens in adjacent squares, then they've created a block. You can't swap places with a token in a block but you can move over it. There are five special squares on the board, each with their own name and design. The square with the Ankh is a safe square, and the token on this square can't be swapped. All tokens must stop on the square with the bird, even if the throw would have moved them past it. They can move past it on their next turn. Landing on the square with the water sends that token back to the square with the Ankh. The last two are safe squares, so tokens can't be swapped. Let's start a game. You can go first. What? Okay. Wait. What is my goal? My goal is to get to the end square? Uh, okay. Can't do that. Can't do that. Can't do that. Something bad. Ha! Ha! Yeah. What did I do? <laughs> I swap with her. Take that, Lily. What am I doing now? Do I, wouldn't I want to just focus on this one? I won. 
I did not win. Oh, there's a question mark. Oh yeah, you have to move. Okay, yeah, you have to remove all the pieces. Oh. <laughs> Can't do oh. that. Can't do that. Okay, so we have to focus on getting all the pieces. All right. Yeah, maybe we should have read that. My bad. Can't do that. Can't do that. Can't do that. Can't do anything, apparently. Okay, as long as I get all of my pieces before her, then it's okay. I think I'm our goal- you back. Look out! You. Yeah! Can't do that. I guess depending on where you're gonna Bad land. Bad news for you. Bad news for you. Bad news for you. Came from. Oh my God, she's owning me. This one to come forward. Ha! Yeah, look at that! Look at that swapperino! <gasps> Can't do that. Oh! Get wrecked. Can't do that. Walk it off, Drew. Darn it, she's already gotten two. Okay, that's fine. There we go. All right, we got we got two down. We got two down. Ha! Yeah, look at that swap. Ha ha. All right. Can't do that. Okay, let's move these. As long as we can stay like one above her, then we're good. Can't do that. Or one ahead. <laughs> am I gonna am I gonna win anything for this? Can't do that. Can't do that. I finally understand <laughs> the colors. I'm like, wait, what does the colors mean again? What does that mean? Four, five. Oh, that means five. This means one. So I have to stop on the bird anyway, so I think that means it's one. Can't do that. Oh, maybe it didn't. Oops. Oh, so close. I thought I, I thought I, okay. Um. Mm -hmm. 
Okay, we got another one. Let's start moving this one up. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, forgot you have to stop at this stupid bird. How many is this? Just one? Okay, yeah. I'm glad I didn't do that. <laughs> is this also just one? Yeah. Woo. One, two. This is just one. This is three. No. We don't want three. We don't want to land on the, this water one. Oh my god, we're almost- Why is she getting all the good rolls? Stop it! Okay. Oh god. Oh no! Oh yeah. Oh. Crap. Oh no. Oh, we're good. Oh my god. We're about to be a winner! What is this game called again? Stop rolling! Jeez! Oh, okay. yeah! Yeah! Taste it, Lily. It was a taste. Oh, God, no. Wait, I didn't do... That's... What? Okay, well, at least now I know. <laughs> Whoa. You cannot go back there. I'm looking for Professor Boyle's notes. His notes are off limits. He wants me to have them. Call him if you don't believe me. I will. Trust me. <gasps> Do it then! Did you know Professor Boyle was attacked? At least that's what the doctors think. Who told you that? He did. Don't I told worry. You that. He's probably just all turned around from the injury. There's nothing to worry about here. Oh my god. See ya. It's, Bye. She's Delulu. She's so delusional. She has just, she's power hungry. Haven't done that. Can't check that off yet. Can't check that. Can't do, haven't done that. Haven't checked that. <laughs> okay, is there, what else can I do? Okay, it looks like I can't go back there. Um. Oh, my mouse died. I was like, did the game just freeze? I was like, why? Why is my why is the mouse not moving? Oh, this is my mouse sign. Oh, is my computer sound? Oh, thank goodness. Alright, good reminder to save. <laughs> Woo, that freaked me out. Yeah! That's so funny. <laughs> it was just my mouse. Hi Kate! Ooh, spray water on her. Wait, <laughs> what why? Okay, is there any other Ooh stuff over here I can look at? No? Okay. Well, let's look around the desert. We've got some water. Stay hydrated, my friends. What is this? Oh. 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 <sighs> Whoa, what is the sound effect of that? Okay. Is there... Can I not? Oh, I can't go that way. This is the tent we were in, right? Yeah, okay, okay. So this is the tent that we were in. Ooh, birds. Is there anything over here? Oh, here we go. What is this? This looks like a map of the site. Ooh, okay. Wow! All right. Why did I think that the 100 bits? Oh, sweet of you. Thank you. Thank you. Five. I'm so sorry, I see. <laughs> Welcome back. Thanks for sticking through them. What is that drawing of? Um, ooh, what's I this? I bet I could translate that. <laughs> oh, I bet I could too. Judged is he by the ancestors of Ra. Okay. 
Okay, yoink. I got the bird. Yoink, got this relic. What? <laughs> what is that photo? Amulets were an indispensable part of ancient Egyptian life worn by both the living and the dead to provide the wearer with special powers and protections. A wide variety of different shapes, materials, and colors are, was available. From a golden fly for military achievements to a fish for good luck. Funerary amulets played a particularly important role in burying the dead. The deceased journey to the underworld and afterlife was believed to be aided by placing various amulets between the layers of their linen wrappings interesting an amethyst monkey was a love charm interesting a felspar hedgehog symbolized rebirth and a basalt baboon imparted wisdom one of the most commonly used amulets was in the shape of a scarab as the sacred animal of the god kipri the scarab embodied, embodied his same powers, most notably rebirth. Other amulets in the animal form of a god or goddess also imbued similar powers as their full human or animal-headed human counterparts. Regular animals not attached to a god held their own powers based on their behavior in the natural world. A hare, given its ability to survive in the unforgiving desert, symbolized regeneration. Regenerative powers were also attached to animals like the hippopotamus that lived in the renewing waters of the Nile. Okay. The lizard with his ability to regrow a lost tail and the baby frogs that would magically appear after a flood. Okay. Funerary amulets offered even more choices, depictions of the sons of Horus, the animals. Okay. What is this? My daughters wanted to be a part of the game and they dressed up as Egyptians and please Nancy, Drew, please put them in your video game. <laughs> what the heck is this? Um, what else? Okay, oh the animals. Happy Duamatif and Quibbehsniff and the human I'm Seti gave protection over the embalmed organs on both canopic jars and amulets. Food offerings in the form of trusted tr truce and tied animals and birds provided meals for the deceased in the afterlife. Headrests and depictions of clothing allowed the deceased to bring their possessions with them. Cool. Ooh, what's this? Strange phenomenon inspectors spied. Farewell Earth, a survival guide for the Earth imminent demolition. That's fun for the whole family. Ooh, nice. Uh, of the universe's foremost alien experts have convinced or convened for hours of consciousness expanding lectures including all of these oh this is sunny june this is like a nancy drew my dictionary could help translate that nancy drew inside joke i don't know inside joke oh okay battery or okay, flashlight need one of those is there anything else i can take Walk like an Egyptian. <laughs> um, let's see. I like the music. Oh. Ooh, okay. Lots of pictures in this one. Uh, animal site grid. All artifacts removed from the tomb must be labeled with the corresponding site grid number from the location where the artifact was found. Okay, well, we got the map, so I'm guessing we're going to have to go come back here to figure out exactly where an artifact was found. Okay, can't click on anything else here. Ooh, there's a lot to do here. Okay, we're just going to take all these little pieces, all these little tools. Okay, we got a... A pick and a brush. Amulets found. Gold fly, lapis baboon, bronze cow. All of this. Good. Good job. 
good on us. Well, it seems like Lily's the only one here, so uh, she I did should it. try to piece the amulet back together. Oh shoot! What? N one three E two. Oh, you can rotate. Does that fit there? No. Does this fit here? Yeah. Um. No. Last piece. <laughs> um, there we go. What is this thing? What am I rebuilding? I like this sound effect. Doesn't this sound nice? One of the top right goes on the bottom. Top right. Top top right goes on the bottom. I think I, I think I might have switched them up. <laughs> oh, there we go. Um. Oh, I can move this whole thing up. So, say, Hannah, thanks for the follow. <laughs> I know I moved it around. Sorry, Lulu. Hopefully not a mummy's curse. Hopefully not. Where does this go? Is this part done? Maybe this part's done. So we have to focus on this part. <laughs> ah! on the right side oh <gasps> yes what the heck oh here we go here we go here we go oh that's i needed that yes here we go oh it's a cat it's a cat it's a cat cat it's a cat There's a piece missing. I wonder where the rest of the amulet pieces were found in the tomb. Okay, we're gonna have to find the piece that's missing. Nailed it! Ooh, thank you! Thanks, Draken. <laughs> Try the green piece. Um, okay. Is there anything else we can do? So wait, this one's N13E2. So... N13E2. In one, three, E2. So it was like the top corner right here. That's where we have to go to, I guess, find the other green pieces. Slay <laughs> Queen. Hi guys. I hope y'all are having a good afternoon or good evening, wherever y'all may be from. Um, I appreciate y'all hanging out with me. We're playing some Nancy Drew. I love playing Nancy Drew games. Oh, wait. Can't check that off yet. That's done. Okay, that's done. Okay, let's keep looking around. Ooh, let's go in the tomb? Yeah. Ooh, look. Cool. Ooh, a shovel. Man, I'm picking up everything. <laughs> Who's behind me? Who is that? Oh, this guy. Ah, you are still here, darling. Oh, you couldn't drag me away. But uh, if you don't mind, I'd prefer Nancy. 
I prefer the distinguished Dr. Raccoon. It appears neither of us is going to get what we want. So I must know, are you very brave or just very stupid? Oh, I'm not afraid of a curse, if that's what you're getting at. It is, but you still haven't answered this my is... question. Uh, this guy's got a big personality. You've never seen this game. It looks fun. Oh my god, these games are so much fun. <laughs> they're older, for sure. Um, they're a little dated, but um, just because they're dated doesn't mean anything, in my opinion. <sighs> Where did I get that orange kitty coffee mug? The Orange Kitty Coffee Mug. Oh, I think it's a Corgi. It's a Corgi and it was a gift, but um, it is on Amazon. I do know that. Um, I'm brave. Oh, I'm very brave. I'm very brave. This is something the truly brave never say. Oh. What's going to happen now that there's been a major injury? Usually it means we are going to be shut down. So now we work fast. Oh gosh, okay. Isabel, thanks for the follow. A corgi? Yeah, a little dog. A little corgi. Oh wait, is it a corgi? No, it's not. It's a Shiba Inu. That's what it is. <laughs> Why did I say a corgi? It's a Shiba Inu. It's a Shiba Inu. Uh, but it looks like a fox. Or it looks like a cat. But it's like the green mug with the little orange. Is that the one that you're talking about? It's like the dark green mug with the little orange animal. It's a Shiba Inu. So maybe type Shiba Inu, green mug. Professor Boyle was supposedly injured by a lightning strike, but the medical reports state that he was struck in the head with a blunt instrument. No, that can't be. That's what he said. This is serious. I know, someone attacked him. Do not be so hasty. We don't know what happened, but it's best you be we careful anyway. But we do know what happened. Think Professor Boyle was attacked. Do you have any evidence? The doctor just said that he was attacked. <laughs> what is this? <laughs> he reminds me of that snooty woman from the Venice. Oh my God, the one on the rooftop. Yeah. I have, I enough. have enough. If I'm wrong and it's an accident, then no harm done. If I just assume it was an accident and let his attacker get away with it, who knows who will get hurt next? Exactly. You are very shrewd. What do you think about Professor Boyle? He's lucky to be alive. It's a good thing professors have such thick skulls. Did you two get along? Get along? I know him. I respect his work. Were you okay with Professor Boyle working the site with you? No. Why not? Oh, there you go. He when did it. When you are the best, like I am the best, no one else can ever help. No, they only get in your way. But Professor Boyle is one of the best archaeologists working today. He wouldn't be getting in your way. One of the best? Pfft, I am the best. That's why this site is mine. What are you working on? This mural here. There is something very important hidden in this wall. I don't know if I can decode it in time. Can I give it a shot? <laughs> no. You want to try <laughs> the other mural up top? <laughs> yeah, sure. I need a few tips for reading the hieroglyphs. A few tips? <laughs> yes, that's how I learned to read hieroglyphs. At first, they were inscrutable and mysterious, but then I got some tips. Just go look in your books. <laughs> Both accents are fantastic. <laughs> and a way to stay humble. All right, buddy. Have you made progress? Did you find anything to say whose tomb this is? I wish I could say we found the lost queen, but I don't know for sure yet. Well, the answer I know. is here. We may find the mummy, but if we do not crack this before they come to shut us down, we may never know who we have found. I mean, the game's name is Do you have any idea what that inscription means? Look at the hieroglyphs. They are not supposed to be riddles, and I still grappled with them, sometimes for years. The actual riddles, <laughs> forget it. That's why I am here, staring at this wall. I cannot think if I am not working. You're alone. Good. Ski hug Miss Sky really enjoy you cozy <laughs> content. And I also see. so nice like ski lava. Thank you so much for 200 bits. This is sweet. Thank you. You're so kind. What do you know about Lily? <laughs> I've seen many like her. What does that mean? Ambitious, young, smart. The ones like that, they achieve. 
or they flame out in a big <laughs> That seems dramatic. The world moves on the back of dramatic lives. I do not think this is a good thing. Lily, she is like a spinning top. She stands straight, but the slightest nudge, she will go ping, flying off in a crazy direction. I do not trust her. Then why did you choose her to be part of the dig? Someone I fully trust would never be able to surprise me. I still don't understand why you would want Lily to work with you. She is smart, and her downfall is being too ambitious. She is so much like me, I'd be a hypocrite to not like her. Okay, vibes, hello. Thanks I'll catch you follow. later. Bye. Yeah, gotta love some Nancy. Okay, so he said I can translate I this. I bet I could translate that. Never enter where? According thereto, let it be found inscribed on the tablet as to anyone who does not know this spell, he shall never enter. Ooh. I love how I can just translate. We literally have like a giant book about how to read <laughs> hieroglyphs and it's like, just translate. Should we tell him? Yes. Bye bye. Oh, I guess See you not. Later. Hi, Rom. We're playing a new Nancy, well, Nan, new Nancy Drew game for me. <laughs> uh, what else? Ooh, can we go in here? Ooh, okay. It looks like the red scarab is missing. Okay. That doesn't make any sense. Oh boy. The jackal symbol is at the beginning and end of this passage. There must be something special about it. The jackal? Oh. 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 What does it mean by the jackal? Um, how do we... Should we guess on a letter? How do y'all think we should attempt this? Do we know at least, like, one of these, like, hieroglyphs? Where was that hieroglyph book? Did I not take it? I guess I couldn't take it. Do you think these are eyes? I? Or an A? Maybe? I don't know. All oh, things roll. <laughs> I don't understand this. How do you, do I just guess? Um. She said so, uh, the jackal is at the beginning and the end. Is this the jackal? Or do they mean like... Is that the jackal? I don't, I don't really get it. I'm not sure. This is how hieroglyphs work, frankly. <laughs> True. Most of this will be trial and error. Trying letters is until things start making sense. Alright. Um... Let's make this one be an H. And this one be a T. And this one be an E. The. The. That seems nice. Like this, right? The. The. Hi, Rhea. Half. <gasps> half. Halfen. <laughs> Is that a word? <laughs> um. That still have to do still have have haven't done that. <laughs> I love clicking it like that. I don't think that's that's the word. Um What it um <laughs> hmm. What about this word? No, this is here, we'll we'll erase that one. We'll erase the in. I don't think it's the in. Maybe this is wrong? Maybe this one's wrong. DJ Nancy. 
I think your V is incorrect. Darn it, you think so? It's possible. What's another very common, because you can see like it's here, it's here, it's here. What's another common three letter word besides the still have oh haven't no well i mean possibly but <laughs> can i help out yeah of course and oh and yeah hold on let's try and and If you've, if you've done this before, then don't suggest what to do. But if you haven't played this before, then yeah. Unless we're like flat out stuck and I'm like, help. And, and works. Or who. That look for single letters. At A. Okay, well, let's see. This one could be A. Or I. Let's do I. That's not a word. <laughs> um. It, uh, let's make, um, should we change this one back to A? I think that one should be A. So maybe it's not and. I haven't played this year, I have, I have played this years ago, but if you think I remember any of this, you're wrong. <laughs> You're good, Lulu. Um, maybe this is Nancy. Uh, let's see. <laughs> let's get rid of the N and the D. Let's assume this is A. And then this is maybe who? I don't really think so, but you know what? Let's try. Ha <laughs> ha. Oh, <laughs> nah, maybe not who. Um, oh. <laughs> what's another one? Four? Let's try four. Four. Mm. Mm. Have it done ones like it? Then you are so so able to give me your opinion. <laughs> I mean, you can always do it anyways. Um, uh, yeah, I know it's all the A and the E's. Hmm. We have to stick to one. That's the problem. Should I go back to the or should I go back to and? Oh, -hoo. the. Let's let's try it. Let's try the again. What could this word be? H O T T O G O. <laughs> I'm just um, um, he, me? No, can't do he. Me? No, I think it's me. <laughs> Hither? R? <gasps> Tr train? Do they have trains in Egypt? Or maybe it means training. Oh, trail? Trail? Uh. Halt. Uh. Look, this could be like. No. Wait. L. What? Not L. You don't think it's L? Do you think it's train? Oh my god, this could be L. Because it could be Nile. 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 Oh, thanks, Flame. <laughs> mm, um. Re
Greet? Preet? 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 I don't know. I don't think that's what I'm Greet? Greet! Greet! Oh my god, we're getting this. Oh my god, this looks good. This is that. Look, that. Oh, air. Okay, let's see. Um, blah, 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 hither. Something in the train. And let the are the air that something hmm. M for I'm okay. Hold on, you're on to something. Where is that? Where here? Oh no, hold on. Because here's I. Because we have in here, and then these are all singular. Or, hmm. Greet was a really good call. Fifth line, I am the hunter. Oh, <gasps> I, oh, it, oh, am, I am, that's what you mean, I am, oh, the hunter, yes! Woo! We're doing this, I am the hunter. <sighs> I am the heir that something, the Nile, I am the hunter. Something that greets the something. Together? Wait, together. Up the Nile. Oh yeah, up. Up the Nile. Oh yeah. What about this one? Eep. <laughs> Creep. Um. Uh, let's see. What about this one? I am blank E.T. It could be the name of a queen or like a person. Keep that in mind. Sheeps? I am the heir that creeps up the Nile. That does make sense. Oh, but whatever's here is always also at the end. Sheeps? That sheeps up the Nile? Sweeps? It has to be an S. Sweeps. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're, you're on to something. I am the heir that sweeps up the Nile. I am the hunter who... Who... Something to greet. Ooh, look at that. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. That C is an S. Oh, yes. Mm-hmm. Hi, Nick. Mm-hmm. The, oh, day. Yes, the new day. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, come. Oh, come. Come ye hither gods in the train of. Looks like I need to find out who the four sons of Horus were. Oh, my God. Y'all are so smart. Come ye hither gods in the, in the train of Horus and let the steps ascend. We are the four of Horus. I am the heir that sweets up the, ni up the Nile. I am the hunter who faces to greet the new day. I am in the... This scared me. I am Imseti, protector of the south. I am the cry that soars towards the setting sun. Together we the gods in the train of Horus guard the corners. Cool. Did we figure out the four sun? Didn't we? I remember hearing something about the about Horus. Did we read something? I don't know. Well, I'll go back to the books in a bit. We did it. Does it save? Okay, good. <laughs> oh shoot! Wait, what? Where am I? Where is this? Do y'all think this is tunnel number two? I'm gonna get lost in here. Oh, maybe I won't. Oh, it's pretty pretty straightforward. I need to see if I can find something that will help me solve this. Twitch chat will help you solve this. Interesting.
Okay, this one can't be moved. Only these, but this one can't. I'm th I'm assuming we have to fill all of the spots in. All right. <laughs> Hi! Hi, Sammy! <laughs> Looks fun. What is this? It's called uh, Nancy Drew Tomb of the Lost Queen. There is a ton of Nancy Drew games. A ton. Um, so take your pick. This is like um, one of the later ones, I guess. <sighs> the gaps have to overlap. I uh, I believe so. Hmm. This works out well. This one kind of fills it. However, this and this one get canceled. So, um, so maybe it doesn't go there. Oh, here, this, this is good. Wait, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. This one's good. This one's good. It matches. Okay, we're we're doing it. This one. That's <gasps> it. Now if I only knew what it meant. Was I not supposed to solve that? <laughs> My dictionary could help oh. translate that. A queen is buried here. I knew it. Great. Wow, we already solved it. <laughs> How long have they been in here? And we already solved that this is the great queen. <laughs> great king's wife, lady of the two lands, beloved of mutt. Okay. Oh, cool. This save. It's still sealed. Oops. Is that oops? <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> oops. Let's save. It's too dark. I need to find something to light the way. Whoa, what are you doing? I think we found the tomb. I've got to see this myself. Oh my god, do we already beat the game? <laughs> what is this? Brilliant. Who is that? Wait, who are these people? It's magnificent. Well. What is this? Look at the hieroglyphs. There is something very important here. It's the curse. Everyone, get out of here. Oh, if I can just get this light to turn back on. No! What's happening? What? What? What happened? What happened? What? <laughs> Is everybody okay? Who are those other people? Hi, Nancy. What? Do you think there's something to this curse? I've studied curses, so look. Don't make me say it. Say what? Yes, I do. Even reading about curses gives me the creeps. Why are you reading about curses if they give you the creeps? <laughs> right. I know, it's weird. It's like if I can learn everything about curses, then maybe they won't have any control over me. I can tell that you probably don't believe in curses, so please don't make fun of me. Um, okay. How can you tell I don't believe in curses? Sorry, I'm just a bit worked up. I'm probably just being oversensitive. You're too calm. Do you know how effective curses are? They are deadly 76.42% of the time. You know what else has that fatality rating? White water rafting with a hungry bear who also has the bird flu and he's holding dynamite. What's that What's book? What's that book? What? Curses of the World, the Compendium of Cruel Curses and Curious Casualties. 
It does have a lot of C's. It yeah, does. doesn't seem like light reading. I was originally going to go into paleontology, but no, I changed my mind freshman year. Why did no one tell me about how creepy curses are when I switched majors? Dinosaurs were bad news back in the day, but now, totally safe. Mummies, on the other hand, I make poor life choices. The curses aren't real. You'll be fine. No. No more taunting the curse. At least not around me. I'm too young to die out here. I have things to do. I'm still in school. I haven't even started my life yet. I'm not tempting fate here, Nancy. I refuse. Okay. I can respect that. We need to get that like a sound. I make poor life choices. <laughs> um, I like how uh, all the characters so far that I've seen, they're very animated. You know? I like it. What did you think about being there to finally open the tomb? I don't know what to think. When I was near it, it just felt... No, it's stupid. What? Something was in that room with me. Whatever it was, it wasn't human. At least not anymore. Don't go in there. Well, there was other people in there. Wait, I'm so confused. Were we not supposed to solve that that fast? It wasn't a hard puzzle. You literally just had to move the stuff around. Right? And then, like, who are those other people? <laughs> I haven't even met all those people. What do you think of Abdullah? Say what you want about how he behaves. He's earned it. What makes you so sure of that? I've studied his career. He's a bit of a jerk, but let's face it. When you think of archaeology, you think of him. He's the best. A decade of dedicated study. Okay, I guess you have a point. Thanks. It just bothers me when people are critical of him. He's sort of a hero of mine. Hmm. I'll catch you later. Later. <laughs> We're supposed to do something to help solve the four. Yes, we need to find that book. Um, I believe, was it in Nancy's thing? This, right? Or no, this was how to read. This was how to read the hieroglyphs. No. There was another book. Oh, is it this one? Oh, there's another queen on this page too. No, these are... These are about the different queens. Nobody's here. Um, all right, let's, oops, let's go outside. Let's go see if there's any more people. Like there's obviously people, but oh, this guy. Hello. Not to be rude, but who are you? Why are you here? I could ask the same of you, but I won't. I'm Dylan Carter to answer the question you didn't ask, but probably meant to. I'm Nancy Drew. Brilliant. Well, good chat. Uh, mustn't keep you from your duties. What do you think of Abdullah? He's got quite the ego, but I'm sure he deserves it. What makes you say that? If he didn't, no one would put up with him. History's great pioneers always tend to be a bit prickly. Sure, he's a tyrant, but he's supposed to be the best in his field. Do you think he is? Who knows if it's true? He's either the best or the guy who says, I'm the best, the loudest. <laughs> Unfortunately, either one of those two things works equally well. You know, he's just on the edge. What do you mean? He's close to what do being we think known about this guy? the world over. He must have gotten a glimpse of what that would be like. I wonder what he'd do to make it over that last hurdle. I like his little setup. <laughs> I hate him. <laughs> Why do I hate everybody? Is it because of his accent? Is it because he's Australian? Why are you hanging out here outside instead of going into the tomb? Why aren't you hanging out outside? What do you mean? I'm outside right now talking to you. I have better things to do. Oh, you do <laughs> not. When you come to your senses, I'll still be here. You know why England tried to take over the world? Oh, he's English, not Australian. Boredom? Boredom? Because we've got everything you need. 
Why Except did they for think the sun. Australian? You know why we stopped trying to take over the world? <laughs> because everyone else got sick of it? That they did. Is the real reason you're hanging out here because you're not cleared to actually go into the site? I was hoping we'd be able to get over that little bump in the road before that cat got out. Before that cat got out. You couldn't tell from his amazing accent. <laughs> Stop, what I'm do sorry. you do exactly? As a tour guide, I show the world to those who want to see it. It's the best job on the planet. Oh, he's a tour Next guide. Next to lion tamer or astronaut. Where do you give tours? All throughout Egypt. That sounds like a fantastic job, but why aren't you leading a tour now? Right? It's getting very competitive these days. I need every advantage I can get. Well, that's why I'm here, to be perfectly on the level I have to be. Since you're a tour guide, can you give me any information about Egypt I might need to know? Sure, here. Gods and goddesses of ancient Egypt, a partial pantheon. Air. Oh, here we go. This is probably how we're gonna find the the Horus people. Air. I can't remember any of the other ones. <laughs> Anyways, I can keep it though. Why are you so sure the public would want to tour this site? Seth. Surely you've heard of the curse. I have. Do you believe in it? Of course I do. But since you're here, you must not be worried about being cursed yourself. I've been gloriously unlucky my whole life. I don't think a curse could make things much worse. See ya. Come back anytime. A <laughs> curse? Mm -hmm. Seth, mix of animals, chaos. Me. Um... Come ye hither, gods, uh, train of Horus. Let the steps ascend. We're four of Horus. I am the air that sweeps with the Nile. I am the hunter who faces to greet the new day. Hunter? Any hunter? 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 War, maybe? Sekhmet? Maybe. Uh, I am Imis. Imseti, protector of the south. Where have we heard Imseti before? It's okay, okay. Well, let's keep looking, actually. There was a girl. Oh, let's have some water. Hydrate yourself, chat. Hydrate. Ooh, what's this? Lamp oil. Ooh, lamp oil. Alright. Lamp oil. Is there anybody else? There's gotta be more people. Okay, definitely this had books and stuff, right? This had the map. Oh, oh shoot, I broke it. Flashlight's dead. <laughs> I'll need to find another light source. What? What the heck? Hydration tech. Actually, I need to get more water. Don't drink the lamp oil. I broke it! My dictionary could help translate that. Wasn't there... Where was this book? I swear there was another book, chat. Where's the book I'm thinking of? No, we are still... We need to find that piece of the cat. Okay, let's still look at our that. Still, still can't check that. Out. Still have, still have. Can't, can't, can't check that off yet. I'll stop. Um. Oh, maybe it was here. There we go. The sons of Horus. This is it. This is it. This is where we read it. According to the myth, the Eye of Horus represents the Eye Horus lost in the battle to Seth. Thoth later magically restored Horus' eye, who in turn offered the restored eye to his dead father, Osiris. Osiris ate the eye and returned to life. The Eye of Horus became a symbol of health and life. It was also used as a magic. Okay. Happy. Duopmatif. Quidibid. 
and uh, human Imseti. Right. I am the air that sweeps up the Nile. Okay, I don't think, maybe this doesn't have anything to do with it, but this is the Sons of Horus, the, these. But we have to figure out, I guess, which, which animal was which for these? Osiris? Pronounced it wrong. Osiris? 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 Sit, sit, still. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, Spuda, how are you? Okay, well, we know the names. We just have to find out what animal they belong to. Um, okay, let's keep looking around. We found this guy. There was a girl. I swear I saw a girl. I'm not going crazy, right? There was another girl, not her, but another one. Oh, here we go. Oh, ooh, I can I can get this. And as a result, the same phrase can often be represented with different hieroglyphs. Take the name Herewinimith. Herewinimith. Ray is with his strong arm. Indicates royal son, always the end of name. Royal daughter. But his brother uses that which also translates to with his strong arm or possibly with his right arm could be open interpretation but the god Ra aka Re can be represented by this <laughs> y'all are getting this right <laughs> no wonder some of these hieroglyphs aren't making any sense there are numerous locations where whole phrases are undecipherable they all seem to be marked by the same unique symbol could it be the builders of this tomb created their own language I think I may be I may be starting to break the code. Regardless, the hieroglyphs around the tomb are giving a strong indication of a royal female presence. Could it be the lost queen? We found the tomb already. The partial inscription encoded from the piece removed from the main room certainly seems to say Part it. Of John's is. notes are missing. That doesn't seem right. Ooh, the tomb within sealed behind her titles acknowledge them fully with no gaps from left to right and it shall be opened according there too let it be wait we did that acknowledge them fully with no caps we did that and that's how it opened her thing i must track down the rest of the inscription if i can find that i'll be on the path to the greatest discovery hmm. and it said another big clue deciphered oh here we go oh clearly clearly she that lily called boyle and now that's why we can go through his stuff what is this dear john i heard at the recent paris and williams archaeological gala that you are still looking for the perfect applicant to round out your team for your upcoming dig in egypt i'm writing to recommend nancy drew as a candidate for consideration nancy worked for us as a deputy deputy curator at beach hill museum where her observational skills and attention to detail provided an invaluable con contribution to the successful opening of our exhibit, finding the Maya, a loss of the late. Oh my God, that's from the red, the scarlet hand. I am confident that you would be ple as pleased with Nancy's work as we were. Her de de deductive reasoning, perseverance, and intelligence are an ideal match for your team's search for answers in the desert. Feel free to contact me. Franklin Rose. Ooh, a lighter. Okay, we got lamp oil and a lighter. Now we just gotta find, oh, a lamp. Oh, I can't take it though. Hmm. You think she'd give me hers? Hi. What do you think about Dylan? Did we accidentally invite the whole world to this dig? With the exception of a decent work crew, that is. <laughs> Team Although Nancy's I do hate smarter that I than all the archaeologists here. here put together. He's definitely real. easy on the eyes. Okay, Lily. Agreed. Agreed. <laughs> but if he stays out in the sun any longer, Wait, he's going Ned. to get all lobstery. Definite turnoff for us land dwellers. 
Bye bye. See ya. Can we call Ned? Oh, Ned is not an option. All right, but you know who is? Mr. London guy over here. All right, um, let's see. There's still one lady. Where, where? Where's the lady? talk to him? Yes. Is it strange that some of the hieroglyphs don't make sense? There is a saying. If a lion could speak, we would not understand him. So let's say one day, magically, poof! A very smart lion learns to speak the king's English. How he understands the world is so radically different that even though you understand the words he spoke, you could never understand what he was trying to say. Is that how you think of the ancient Egyptians? Yes. Now let me show you why <laughs> so I am the best archaeologist in the world in one simple step. Okay, go ahead. I am Ramses the Second. I thought you looked familiar. Please, I am much more handsome than he was. Now pay attention. I, Ramses the Second, I look at my kingdom. Look at it with me. Be Ramses with me. Come now. Survey the kingdom. We are kings. Look at the sands. They part in the most elegant tribute to our majesty. Listen to the river. You are not doing it. I can't do it. It's too silly. I can't do it. It's too silly. No. Refusing to learn. That is silly. Again. Listen to the river. That is better. The birds of prey and even the deadly serpents bow before us. They look to us as if we were the sun. And remember, we are Ramses. We are the sun, most favored by Ra, sun god. The heartbeat of this world is for us. I mean... Looking at all of this, what do you want? What could I possibly want? Exactly. Now tell me, what are you afraid of? I guess losing what I have. Yes, you are ah. thinking like a pharaoh. Now tell How are you? Thank you for 67 months. I can't lose anything. I'm the Pharaoh. Wrong. You can and you will. You will die, Ramses II. You will be gone and forgotten. Okay, but how does all of this lead to the Lost Queen? For thousands of years, the lion spoke and no one understood. But understand the fear and you understand the man. Okay, all right, I see what he's doing. <laughs> You're no fun, have fun and try. I know. <laughs> uh, it's been, been nice weather. It's been, what, very nice weather for hours? Just started walking to McDonald's and it starts pouring down. Now I'm stranded. No, Specky, you did it. Oh, Ben, you didn't bring an umbrella? I guess you didn't know it was gonna rain. I'm sorry. How you doing today, Brain? Thank you again for the resub. Um, Dylan. Do you know Dylan? I know of him. You do? So he has a reputation? He is a very popular guide, for whatever that is worth. I do not like guides. They distort history and turn the other way, as sticky-fingered tourists steal every bit of Egypt they can find. <laughs> that seems a little harsh. Not harsh enough. Every tourist thinks, what will it hurt? I'll just take one small piece of the pyramids. And they come, and they come, by the millions they come. And bit by bit, they smuggle our history back in their luggage. <laughs> They're worse than the museums. What do you think of this tomb? What are you getting at? It's amazing, the amount of detail, the size. Well, someone really important must be buried here. After 5,000 years of recorded history, that could be said about every hole in the ground. But that's what you think, isn't it? I don't leave the house for anything less than amazing. So, it's safe to assume this is going to be a major find? You tell me. What do you mean, you tell me? We, we already found the tomb, sir. <laughs> what the heck? 
At least the forecast says it will stop in 15 minutes. That's good. Same Fiz Fizelli? Oh my god, that would be cool. Be the fly on the wa wall while they're developing this game. I would love to see how they did it for like past Nancy Drew games. Like a documentary or something. I would love to know. Mm -hmm. Who do you think is buried here? No, I do not guess. Who are you hoping to find here? Who does everyone want to find? The lost queen. Oh, Who Nefertari. Nefertari. Why is she lost? Over 100 years ago, they found her tomb. The most magnificent of its kind. But when they opened the tomb, do you know what they found? A different mummy? A different mummy? They found two kneecaps. The queen was nowhere to be found. Why is that? Nobody knows. I say Just her kneecaps? she was never there to begin with. Do you have proof? No. The people who had proof have been dead 100 times longer than they were ever alive. So they're not talking. We have to learn to think like they did. But it's not easy. Anyone who says different lies or is stupid. Hi, Sam. Uh, kneecaps. Interesting. What a really interesting thing to leave behind. Like, oh, I forgot my kneecaps. <laughs> Guess I don't need those. Do you think international teams have stolen artifacts from Egypt? No, I do not think. I know. Ooh. You don't seem very happy to have Dylan here. Good. I'm glad you noticed. If this were my site, like it should be, he'd be out on the sand with his hat in his hand, trying to catch a ride back to Cairo. And he would never find one, because there is no street. <laughs> okay. Sorry for being a stream for... No, I don't apologize! What the heck? No, never apologize. I'm just happy you're here. Ooh, how was vacation? Are you been... Are you still at vacation, or... You were on... You just got back from vacation. <laughs> they done took my kneecaps. I translated the hieroglyphs. Beginner's luck. Goodbye. See you later. <laughs> okay. Beginner's luck. Okay, so this is where I came in. I kind of get turned around easily. So we went this way, right? I think we went this way. Oh, God. Oh, <gasps> the girl! The did not scare you away. It'll take oh more than God. a little sandstorm to get me to leave. I was wondering where she was. Shh. Do not tempt the Anunnaki. The what? I should not have even spoken their name. Disregard that. <laughs> I didn't mean to say Anunnaki. Oh, blast. I said it again, didn't I? I'm Jamila, by the way. Jamila. But if anyone asks, you haven't seen me. Why are you here? Well, I can't exactly be there, now can I? That would make no sense. Wow, we found her. I was wondering where she was. What do you think of Abdullah? Not much. He talks always like there is an audience near. But what audience would listen to such a tedious man? I say let him think he's in charge if it makes him happy. You don't think he should be in charge? I don't think he's capable of being in charge. He doesn't even believe in the Anunnaki. She keeps saying it. <laughs> well, screw you, sir. <laughs> what do you think of Dylan? <laughs> the tour guide? Yeah. Did yeah. I have to have an opinion of him? I guess not. Oh, good. That's a relief. Uh, okay. Are you worried about the curse? Who could be worried about a curse at a time like this? A time like what? The makers. The original architects. They're watching. Who are you talking about? <sighs> Nancy. They can't hear you. You do not have to pretend. I'm not pretending. What are you talking about? How could you not know? This is the cradle of civilization. Right. Here we were born. And like all infants, this is where we were taught. Taught what? To be human. We didn't just figure that out. But for millennia we lived in caves, terrified of the very earth, of fire and wind and lightning. We cowered and dug down into the earth. But one thing of all humans, we are curious. One night, 
Our ancestors saw the sky catch fire, and the brave ones left their caves and walked into the light. And there they met the Anu... the teachers. I don't follow. They brought us to the next level of consciousness, and in return we built them the pyramids. Interesting way of thinking. Uh, let's just go along with it. That makes sense. It does? You didn't expect me to agree. Most people take a little convincing. Oh. <laughs> if we built the pyramids with the aliens, why did they all just leave? Oh, they didn't leave. They're all around us. Do you want me to call them? No. Yeah. Oh, well, that's a shame. What? They're an amazing sight. She They're believes in aliens? And tall, and they have the most gorgeous, glowing, luminescent fangs. Fangs? What? This lady? Huh? <laughs> interesting. Personalities are definitely interesting. I feel Nancy's writing can't keep up. <laughs> She's like, wait, what? <laughs> She's nuts. When did you become so interested in aliens? Sunny June. Sunny June. I knew I it! I took his Are You Alien or Ailey Out course. Ailey Out. Changed my life. Did you know that Changed aliens were there every major human milestone, with the exception of the moon landing? All right, I'll bite. Why? Because it was a rude thing to do, and they wanted no part of it. <laughs> Who is Sunny June? Ah. I've seen his name everywhere, but we've never He's met. In every I can't explain it all to you, Nancy not now. Game. He's special. He's met them. Met who? He's met them. You don't make this easy, do you? To be fair, neither do you. True. The Anunnaki. He's spoken to them. He knows that they're on their way. Who invited this girl? I know, I love that they call it alien now. Ali, Ali out. Alien now? Ali out. Whatever. <laughs> I can't say it. I'm still not a believer. I'm still not a believer. But look around. This temple is proof. There is no way all of this could have been built without their help. All those things seem like human accomplishments to me. As they were designed to look. But I had hoped that you could see the strings and not just the puppet. Okay. Well, we Bye. met her. Bye. We definitely met her. What is this? This is. Oh, bird! Bird. It's stuck. Oh, okay, so I have a bird and a bird. Oh, wait, I have a hoopy, hippo, hoopo, and a vulture. I guess I need to collect more of these. Was there, was there any more? I didn't even. This is approximately where the other amulet pieces were found. Ah, 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 ah. So we're like up here. We're in tunnel two now, okay. Oh, that makes sense, the two. Let's shuffle. Oh. oh, I found it! Is there anything else to shovel? Wait, was that it? Wow, good. Oh, okay. Okay. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Can't check that. Did that? Haven't done that. Can't check. Did that? Check. Have. Have it. Can't. Can't. Can't okay. check that off yet. Find a way to snoop Lily and Abdullah's bunks. Use the shattered piece to completely rebuild the amulet. I can do that now. Now that I got this piece. Why is the music like that? Find and re replace the missing scarab. Figure out figure out who the four sons of Horus were. Still have to do that. Well, technically we did, didn't we? Anyways, find out everything you can about Dylan. Why do we need to find everything we can about Dylan? Who? What else do we need? And maybe we need to call the professor. I guess. Let's go back in the tomb. Where was the tomb? So if that was. Matt, Tunnel 2. This is Tunnel 3. This is so odd. I can't click on anything in there. Okay, here we go. The flashlight isn't working. Oh, I better right. find something else to light the way. Right, I need to find like a... Oh. A lamp! Great. I just need to find a way to get it working. Oil. And. Fire. I wonder if I could find a way to light the entire room. 
Oh! Oh. The heck? What is the whispering? What the, Where are these... Why are these coming from? Why is it being so dramatic? it it's like so close it's because you're lighting up more of the room oh yeah, true i haven't played this one myself so i'm puzzle useless i'm afraid all good usually i just brute force it <laughs> i'm gonna be honest with you um uh pretty much oh oh, oh. What? 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 Oh. What? <laughs> hmm. I I I see more. Hmm. <laughs> I know. But I love it. I love it when it's dramatic for no reason. <laughs> it makes you like so like worried about what the heck is going on. You're like, what was that sound? Um Which one can I do a little twisteroni on? Huh. Just need it do it to go just a little bit down. Just a little bit down. Let there be oh, lamp. there we go. We did it. Never mind. Now we shall explore here. Let's see. Explore the tombs. Ooh, but I'm nervous. It looks like something is missing. Ah, something is it missing. It looks like something is missing. What the this? It looks like something is missing. Ah, a pick. It looks like something is missing. Okay, I don't think I have it. Ah, okay, way too heavy. If I could make some sort of lever, <gasps> I bet I could use that hole and open the coffin. What was that? It sounds like it came from the entrance. Whatever, focus, uh, focus, Nancy. Why does it sound so weird? Like she's like doing it in like a cup. <laughs> Imagine voice acting like that. <laughs> Okay, um, is there, okay, I get, oh. <gasps> oh, look, there's coins. Okay, so we got a falcon, a human, a jackal, and a baboon. Now, we learned, now this is probably the, the sons of Horus. The human, obviously the human token. Um, we have Happy, Duamutef, and this person. But, okay. So we have a Jackal, a Baboon, and a Falcon. So I guess we have to figure out which one is what. Okay, I thought I was, I thought I was figuring something out there. <laughs> Did we put them it here? It looks like something is missing. It looks like something okay, is no. missing. Alright, well, oh. My dictionary could help translate that. That's not good. Now everyone, I have to know what the rest says. Everyone who had been in this place, 
They are wretches. There is no remedy for them because I know their names. Beware. This is the taste of death. Darkness shall conceal them. Sids. He's so... Oh, here we... Oh, here we go. Here we... Here we go. Here we go. We have to do this again. Oh, wait, it's it saved. Uh, uh What would this one be? Here we go again. I know, right? And it's not Anne. Um What's a what's a ad? <laughs> Hmm. Maybe this one's O. Of. In that case, we've already done one. Yeah, I'm thinking this, it still counts from the last one that we did, maybe? One. Uh, maybe four? I believe that one was the... Okay, I guess some of them keep and then some of them don't, which is weird. Who? Oh, wait. Oh, we're doing this right. Onesie. Uh, no. Uh. Wrote. Huh. Broke. Who broke? Yeah, B R O K E. Something. What would what this would be? Question for the who broke the seal? Ah, 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 seal, seal. Um. What is this word? A tones. Oh. A Tonys. <laughs> Wait. Uh, yeah, there's an I. A Tony's. <laughs> you? Oh, you. Good, good, good. As for the one who broke the seal, agonize. Yes, agonize. Agonize of. Death. That's not good. <laughs> it doesn't sound good. As for the one who broke the seal, agonize of death await you. I broke the seal, chat. That's me. I'm gonna die. My dictionary could help translate that. Lady of Terrors, sovereign lady, mistress of destruction. Oh, how nice. Is that whose tomb this is? Fantastic. All right, let's go check what happened. Uh, everybody okay? Everybody okay? Are you okay? Yes. Uh, wait, the scaffolding fell down! That was a close call with the scaffolding. Don't die. Yeah, I've seen worse. Twenty right? years ago, we were in a tomb, a minor site. A guy, much like your boy Dylan, kicked over a support beam and crash! It all came down. Seven of us, trapped under stones, big as automobiles. What happened? Five of us were eventually pulled out. What happened to the other two? What do you think happened? Do you think this has anything to do with a curse? Does it matter? All right. Do you believe in the curse? Of course. Really? Then aren't you worried about being here? No, no, no. I am Abdullah Bakum. Curses have no power over me. What makes you so sure of that? I'm still alive. Many men cannot say the same thing. 
The true power of a curse, it lives here. What do you mean by that? <laughs> the curse of Antifi warns, any man who enters my tomb, I will cast the fear of myself into him. I went into that tomb. And? And I knew the fear of Antifi. A curse, when it has you, is like a strange sickness, a fever, and it never goes away. But I thought you didn't believe in curses. No, I said curses have no effect on me. I am strong. Everyone else is a different story. Look at Lily and see what I mean. <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> what okay, do you what think is... of Jamila? Oh, I'm so what curious. What do you think? She believes aliens built the pyramids. She is a waste of my time. So I take it you <laughs> don't believe in aliens? Let me stop you there. Normally when people say that, they have more to say. I do not. If you do not have enough faith in humans to believe that we invented pushing, dragging, and lifting without the help of aliens, you are terminally wrong and incredibly stupid. We will never agree on anything. Are you okay with her staying here? <laughs> no. <laughs> Get out of my sight! You do not own this temple! Leave now or I will remove you myself! I'd like to see you try. What did she I start? She sure seems determined to stay. Well, what did I start? Holy cow. I got him like riled up to go and try to force her out. Can't check that off yet. What is it? It popped up. Find out what Jamila is hiding Can't her Can't check handbag. that off. You still have to do that. Oh, I got a piece of board, I guess. I bet I could translate that. What am I missing here? Oh, living ones, who art thou? Who art thou that hast come? Thy heart is covetous. Hearken ye. Ye shall not remove this tombstone from this its place forever. Do not rob, but act against the robber without allowing any people to tread upon this holy ground. Then you will hear the secret. Something. I need to translate oh. the hieroglyphs. Oh, this one's the always. Is it maybe T H this maybe? Oh. This is the Tomb of Nef uh, Tari. Nefertari. Could this be true? Wow, Nancy. Man, you do doing work. All My these dictionary people, could help translate that. All these people don't know what the heck they're doing. Hey, hey, hey. This is a tomb of Nefertari. I bet I could translate that. But how do we find out the source of the- Did crack? that? Oh, we did. Okay. Alright. Um, should we go talk to that lady? Oh, she's gone. She's gone. Chat. Okay, let's go outside. Maybe she's outside. Oh, look, he's back. Yes? How did you get into archaeology? I was a student, like Lily. I went out on a dig one day, and it was a very, very small tomb. Inside, nothing remarkable. Mummies, no hieroglyphs. But once I lowered myself down into the dark, dusty tomb, I felt a strange flutter in my chest, right here, and... I do not know what overtook me, but I knew I had to push very hard on this wall. And it gave way. And you know what was there? What? I had opened the door thousands of years back in time. Ancient Egypt was down there. I have never again been the same. What are these people doing here? I can't even translate those. I don't know, man. Like, you just bring me along and I do all the hard work. They're sitting here trying to figure out if this is the tomb of the lost queen, and then here we are like, oh, found it! Found the tomb! 
Oh, I found proof. <laughs> like me. Little old Nancy. Why would Ramses go through all the trouble to hide Nefertari away in a false tomb? Nefertari was most dear to Ramses II. He built her the most beautiful tomb of all the queens. He even built for her a temple at Abu Simbel. Wherever he stood, she stood by him. He was very afraid she would not find him again in the afterlife. He wanted her hidden away for eternity, somewhere small and unremarkable where no one would think to look for her, until the time was right. This is small and unremarkable? For you and me, no. For Ramses II, this is a one-room flat in a bad part of town. <laughs> what will you do if we find Nefertari? I will take her to see the world. Well, she can't exactly see anything. She's dead. I know she's dead. I'll let the world see her. I will teach everyone why she is important. Doesn't the world already know that? No, they don't look hard enough. They need me to show them. Do you really care about teaching people, or just about the exposure? Oh. It has been a long time since someone has had the nerve to speak to me in that manner. You didn't answer my question. Dang, Nancy! I won't. I won't answer any question in that tone. Not from you, not from the press, not from some American colleague. I have work to do. Leave me to it. Bye. Nancy's See you later. fighting back. Dang. Is there anything here I can click on? It looks like I can use this piece of wood, though, to maybe open that tomb. But before I do that, let's finish that cat artifact. Here we go. Got it. Here we go. Whoa! Nice. I got the cat amulet. And was it supposed? Oh, did I need it for something? Okay. All right. Did we? What else? Haven't done. Can't check that. Can't check. Check. Did that. Still haven't. Can't check. That's done. Still have to do. Can't check that off yet. We have to figure out what's in our handbag. Here, let's talk to this well, guy. Well, hello. Let's ask all the people about all the people. Really curious to know how many games off of Steam's library you have played over the years. Oh god, I would like what to know too. What do you think about Jamila's alien theories? Not much. <laughs> Subject change. Do you happen to know how a bloke like me might impress that cantankerous old curmudgeon down below? You mean Abdullah, right? I very much hope there isn't another one. Hmm, I imagine he responds to people talking about archaeology. Brilliant. I'll do that. Thanks, Nancy. What do you think of Jamila? Is she for real? Because, wow, I've met some nutters in my life, but that girl belongs in a museum herself, with a little tag that reads, Insanus Totalis. Sounds like a spell. Oh, she's just different. Insanus no, Totalis. No, I'm different. She's a crazy Sorry, little robot to drift in a vast sea of insanity. I'm trying not to. <laughs> I'm sorry. What do you think of Lily? She's definitely my type. What do you mean? Cute, interesting, and not interested. Just like my last girlfriend, very driven. PhD student, probably has a cramped apartment full of dehydrated plants. She's probably going to come off a little rough-edged. <laughs> okay, so that's his type. Wow, he likes Lily. Ooh, let's go tell Lily. I'd better get going. Come back anytime. Ooh, let's go tell. Let's go tell her. Dylan likes you. Wait. Why does this make me so thirsty? I kind of want to go get some more water and refill up my water bottle. <laughs> it's this desert. Hello. Dang it, it doesn't say anything. We can't tell her that Dylan likes her. No! He likes the maniac shouty type. <laughs> Huh, interesting. <laughs> Stop doing hydration checks. Wait, y'all go do the hydration check. I just dr I just drank some stuff for Nancy. I'm gonna go get a drink. <laughs> Hold on. <coughs> Awkward silence. 
I thought it would keep it up, but it didn't. Uh, it's okay. You said you studied curses. Aren't they just mostly hoaxes? No, far from it. There's always a scientific reason for what really happened, but if you get some deadly disease or the world collapses on you, you're not going to care about the biology or physics of what's killing you. What? Why not? What do you think of Jamila? When she <gasps> talks to me, I always Lulu. keep checking for the hidden camera. Huh? No one can be that nuts. I'm still convinced we're going to end up on a hidden camera show called Suckers Talking to Crazies. It does kind of sound like Bess. I wonder if they use the same voice actress. They always make Bess a little bit more high, high pitch, squeaky sound. I don't know a better way to explain it. And hers is more like earth, earthy, like lower pitch. That's how it sounds like to me, at least. Don't you think you're being a little harsh? But it sounds like same. I'm nowhere near as harsh as she is crazy. You could take that to the bank. And it's crazy also bank. the crazy bank. <laughs> Wait a second. I didn't even... Do you actually agree with her about aliens? Oh my god. Oh, I can say crazier things have happened. Hmm, what should I say? Let's say that. Well, crazier things have happened. Okay, so you're nuts. <laughs> I'll make a note of it and hide the sharp things. I don't know why Abdullah doesn't just kick her out. I'd better get going. Bye. Well, technically, didn't he kick her out? She's toxic. She's toxic, chat. She's toxic. Toxic, toxic. Was there anything else in here that I needed? Stay out of there. Whose is this? Oh, this is Abdullah. Okay. Um, we need to, like, distract her so that we can be... Literally, it says we need to snoop through her stuff. Freaking shut up, Lily. I know. Yeah, I hate her. <laughs> All right. Still have to do that. Still haven't figured out everything about Dylan. Why do we have to figure out about Dylan? All right. Anything else? Where'd that girl go? Hello. I'd better get Hello. going. Hello. Hurry back now. Ooh, don't oh don't worry about me sa is there any other place i can like click no i guess not all right back in the tomb we go yeah, we have a piece of a stick so because of that where'd the girl go where'd the girl go yes. I'll catch you later. She's gone. Goodbye. You know what? Maybe I didn't explore all three tunnels. Um, but if, I'm gonna be honest. I, I, tunnel number one, tunnel number two, and tunnel number three um, confuses me. Oh, maybe we didn't go in here. Did we go in here? Oh, we did. Okay. We went in here. Can we go in here? Oh no, I don't think we did. Haha! -ha. What the heck? Okay, there's nothing I can click on. Now! Uh, where's the map? So, I'm assuming we're in tunnel number one because it's really short. Tunnel number two is where that girl was. And then tunnel number three is where the tomb is. Is there anything I can click on? I literally don't think there's anything I can click on. Huh. Okay. Alright. Mm -hmm. Alright, alright. Literally nothing. Alright, let's go with the one with the tomb. Oh, there she is! Hello. How well do you know Lily? I like Lily. She's not a friend to the cause, but I can look past that. Friend to the cause? You know, rolling out the red carpet for our celestial others. Oh, that. I've been trying we to teach her about the true purpose of the hidden tombs, but she's not receptive. Earlier, you said true purpose of the tombs. What did you mean? 
The Anunnaki Hi. had much to teach us. Too much. They hid the secrets on Earth. And when we master all these lessons, they will return to the temples and they will take the most enlightened among us with them. What will happen to everyone else? But for those who do not pass the test, there will be war and famine. The Earth's rage will overcome them and they will fall. The blue light of the Earth will go dim in the night sky. That is bleak. <laughs> I know, right? That is why I tried to get Lily to embrace the Anunnaki. She does not care. Yeah. I'd better get going. Until later. That's <laughs> so cheery! Oh, this is her bag. Okay, so we need to figure out how to open this. Oh. This won't do it alone. This won't do it alone. What does she mean this by that? Do, do I need to get more pieces of wood? This won't do it alone. I know, Nancy! Oh, here we go. Oh, it this looks will like be... something is missing. There we go. Here we go. Got a spear. All right. There it is. Oh, wow! We found the mummy. I need to figure out what these symbols mean before I do anything. It won't budge. Must be locked. I need to figure out what these symbols mean before I do anything. Oh, here we go. <laughs> wow, look at this. Uh, the... Man, there's a lot of these puzzles. It's like the same puzzle. The... Do you think that's heavens? Um... It's possible it's not heaven. Madrona, thanks for the biz. Thank you. <laughs> oh, hey, queen. I know. Like, let me uh, just open this up real quick. Uh, protection. P R O T C I. The procession of blank. Blank. The reveal. See the blank, blank the protection of the heavens. Hmm. Uh. Mm. What do we think? What do we think this word is? Maybe this one's seem, S E E M, seed, seed, the hmm. seek, seek the oh seek. out what this means the procession of gods begins the reveal seek them out under the protection of the heavens all right that makes no sense to me i need to get the correct gods to their proper locations We got the bird, the falcon, the scarab, the lion, the alligator. Um, what? What are we thinking about for this puzzle chat? I know I see, I see six. 
little areas here. Am I? But I'm not su just supposed to click, right? Like these, right? Hmm. Well, here we go. I did all six different ones, but nothing happened. Not sure. Can't check that off yet. Search the entire site for references to the heavens. Discover who's inside the coffin. Haven't done that. Check. Uh, we found a way to get in the sarcophagus. Haven't done that. What is there more to find out about Dylan? I'm so confused. Can't check that off yet. Still can't check that off yet. The heavens? Is there anything about the heavens in, in this book? And I also have these like, what are these things? These little thingies. These little thingies. Where else would we figure out? My dictionary could help translate that. Nancy, what's been going on? I opened the sarcophagus. You did? Oh, I didn't expect you to be so excited. I doubt it has anything to do with the Anunnaki. You never know. I'll have to see this room myself. Oh shoot, what have we- Oh, perfect! I can't open it, it's locked. I need to open this. hoping it was going to be one of those puzzles where something stays down and then I have to figure out the order. But I, uh, what? So this is the Eye of Horus, right? Didn't we read, did we, something in here? <laughs> right? This thing, maybe? Here, the Wedge Jack. supposed to touch this like 64 times <laughs> no fractions um huh that'd be insane I yeah I, I agree I don't see the puzzle doing that but I mean, it's got to be something to do with this. Is this how they used to play Just Dance before video games? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um, how do we know, like, what... Maybe there's, like, an order to the sight, hear, taste, smell, or whatever? What is Wedge at? Is that just the name of the eye? Assigned a mathematical fraction and a sense to each eye, section of the eye. Yes. Heck. I, I don't understand. Can't check that off yet. If I go away, will she be back? Okay, no. Man, this girl's like, nobody's gonna be getting in my bag. <laughs> you have to do fractions to do this. 
I really don't get it. You know what this calls for? Where's the exit? Let's call people! Let's call John Boyle and tell him what's been going on. He's our boss. Nancy, hello. Push it in order of what? Like smallest to largest? We could do that. Here, let's talk to him because we haven't talked to him. A tour guide just appeared oh, yeah, out of nowhere. Oh, yeah, Really? Yeah, really. He showed up when we found the tomb. You're 100 kilometers outside of Cairo. That's too far afield to have a wacky next door neighbor. Huh? Uh, sorry. I'm not used to watching this much television. It's doing so it is true that he appeared brain. when I saw Whatever the tomb. Whatever he says, he didn't just drop in. He must be up to something. Oh, okay. Abdullah seems confused by the hieroglyphs in the tomb. Really? You sound surprised. <laughs> Astonished, dumbfounded, uh, with a twist of smug thrown in to soothe my ego. So, if he's confused... Then it is confusing. He's one of the brightest minds in the field. If he's stumped, something unique is going on here. Lily seemed upset about me doing any work here. <laughs> Show me a PhD student who isn't upset about something, and I'll build you your very own pyramid. Why would she want to keep me away from your work? I have no clue. If she wants to play at being in charge, let her. It'll save you a lot of headaches. What do you know about Lily? Not much. She's with Abdullah's team. It's just strange that she's out there. Why? I never say a critical word about a student, but uh, the archaeology community is small. People talk. <laughs> I guess all I'm going to say is... It's surprising Adela put her on his team. You can't just leave it at that. The curiosity center of my brain is going to go into full meltdown. I can't, Nancy. It wouldn't be appropriate for me to talk about it. Oh my god, let's start talking about aliens. Are you <laughs> familiar with the Anunnaki? Oh, please. Not you, too. No, Jamila. She's got a lot to say on the topic. Uh, good. I'm not saying there isn't alien life, but why insist that aliens built the pyramids? Humans have made a mess of so many things. Just let us keep that check mark in the victory column. What do you know about Abdullah? Mm, he's almost as brilliant as he thinks he is. He seems a little full of himself. <laughs> a little? With that amount of swagger, you'd think he invented sand. Do you think he's behind your attack? I don't think so. This isn't the first time we've butted heads. I'd think that if he were to attack me, he wouldn't sneak up from behind. How's the oh. recovery coming? Good. I am at the point where watching television is tedious again, so that's a good sign. TV is very frustrating for the solution-oriented personality. I don't think I've heard that before. It's true. I find myself yelling, test your hypothesis before acting on it at all of the sitcoms. Truthfully, I'm still feeling a little woozy. As Let's soon talk as to Hotchkiss now. Feeling dizzy, I am on my way back to the site, even if I have to sneak out of here. I better Hotchkiss. get going. Catch you later. All right. Hotchkiss. Oh, this is where I can ask for hints. Hotchkiss. I miss calling Hotchkiss Ned, though. Here? We it's have Nancy Bess. Drew. Oh, Francine, dear. Francine! I'm so glad you called. I've been having the most infuriating problem with my internet. This is Nancy Drew. Oh, you young people are so refreshing, always in search of new identities. The problem is that I downloaded this program called Weather Monkey. At my age, it's important that I keep abreast of all meteorological developments. But now I'm starting a new book, and I can't focus on my work because the Weather Monkey keeps yelling the weather at me. Maybe you should uninstall it? I will do no such thing. That would be tantamount to murder. <sighs> Maybe <laughs> turn it down? Brilliant and fantastic. Oh, yes, Samantha, you are a ticket. I would love to help I you. I love her voice actors. How do I know you again? Nancy, Drew, we've met a few times. Aha, now I re 
remember you. If life were a good book, you'd be my favorite reoccurring character. <laughs> I'm in Egypt, and I need your help. <laughs> the heck? Egypt? I live well, in it. Who are you? you say that instead of chattering away about my internet problem? I don't know how to respond to that. I read your book, and I thought maybe you could help. You found my book while you were in Egypt. <gasps> the serendipity is as delectable as Chateaubriand's oh, mother right. Her in book. Lavender Ooh, we should go check it. I am at your disposal. I didn't exactly find it. You sent it to me. You even signed it. Oh, dear. I sign and send lots of things. <laughs> she doesn't even remember. Oh, <laughs> oh brain! Is this a, is it a nice name for a weather app? Happy Sunday, Devin. Have you How heard you of doing? an expedition that went off in search of Nefertari years ago? Oh yes, the team in which everyone died. Is that the one? Yes. Do you think that story is true? Oh heavens, yes. It's deadly out there in the desert. Think about it. You're going out there in search of dead bodies. There must be a reason they're in favor of the area. But this expedition wasn't searching for QV-66, right? Indeed not. That had already been discovered. They were searching for Nefertari's mummy. What do you think happened to them? Oh, it's best you not concern yourself about that now, given your current location. Wow, that's a lot. Bye! See ya. Goodbye. Goodbye. <laughs> that's a lot to talk. Uh, hold on. I want to check her book. I wanted to read about Nefertari. Here. Oh, no, that's Nefertiti. Nefertari, not to be confused with Nefertiti, was the favored wife of the great pharaoh Ramses II. During his long reign, Ramses had many principal wives, but Nefertari was his first and best-loved queen. She and Queen Tia were the only queens to be defy, defied while they were still alive. De, or de, de feed? How, what is that word? Uh, while they were still alive. Wait, what, 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 what does that mean? The small temple at Abu Simbel was built to honor her and the goddess Hathor. The statues of Nefertari on the temple's facade are the same height of those as Ramses, indicating her high status. Deified? What does that word mean? I'm, I don't think I've ever heard of it. D E I F I. What does it mean? Let's see. Worshipped, regard, or treat. Uh, they were the only queens to be worshipped while they were still alive. Okay. That's what it means. Um, the statue of Nefertari on the temple's facade are the same height, right? Ramses also built her a tomb in the Valley of the Queens. This tomb is one of the best preserved today, and the vivid colors of the paintings within, within still grace the walls. When the tomb was rediscovered in 1904, it was found to have already been visited by tomb raiders. Of the items originally placed within... To accompany Nefertari in the afterlife, only a portion of mummy and few broken pieces remained. Her kneecaps. English, I know. What is this? Just doing some society quest in 14. Oh, that's nice. That sounds like a nice relaxing Sunday. I don't... I haven't done any of that stuff yet. I need to. Alright, we were gonna try to get in that girl's bag, right? Where was her bag again? Oops. This is... Oh! Wait, was this always here? Oh, we found the red scarab. Wait, what? Since when? Wait, what was this for again? We found it! We found it! Can't check that off yet. What do you mean? Haven't done that. Oh, I guess I didn't find the missing scarab. Maybe this leads us to the missing scarab. Oh, shoot. I forgot where... There was, like, a puzzle on the side or something. Right? <sighs> I can't remember. In here? 
Everything's looking the same. <clears throat> oh, here we go. Maybe the color has something to do with the solution. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, guys, I am not good at these type of puzzles. I'm not good at them. Darn it! <laughs> no! Who's who's good at this? One of you have has got to be good at this. Ooh, look, I can do the white one. Done. We're done. We got one. How do we get this one? <laughs> These puzzles are so hard for me. I can't, I don't know. I feel like I need all four to like get them all. It's like the green one, maybe the green one's first. You know? There. Maybe the green one's first. Done. Oh, then the black one! Huh, but then what about the white and the red one? <laughs> Ooh, I don't like these puzzles. Scopa. Scopa. I prefer Scopa, I honestly think. Um, I know, right? Will <laughs> she solve the puzzle? We'll find out next episode. Um, darn it. I got this. I got this. No, I don't got this. Don't get it, Chen. Don't get it. Oh, I do got it. Oh my god. Three out of four. But the red one's impossible, isn't it? The red one's impossible. I need other things. Dang it. If only the red one was right here. No, Tad, no. If you put, if you push black up, it can be used to get the red one. And then the black could be out. Red up, white up. Okay, red up, white up. <gasps> What? So smart, guys! I should look around for a clue to solve this. <gasps> no. It oh, this. Now, what exactly does it do? just happened I should see if I broke something is it my imagination or did the columns move oh ah there's four columns and they move I'm guessing we need the columns to go all the way to the top? 
Whoa, that's cool. I totally guessed the placement of these. Okay, I moved it, so let's see what happened. This one went down. These two went down. Interesting. Okay, let's just see what happened. Oh, wait. Oh, she's back. I never got in her bag. How the heck? Hmm. The only way I can think about this is to just keep playing around with it. Hi. Yeah, actually, let's I talk saw to some her. really strange hieroglyphs in one of the tunnels. You might want to see. Oh, this you is did? how we. Oh, this is how we trick her. Oh, and we need to get in her bag. Okay, well, hold on to the columns. One second. Let's do this. This thing. So, do you think it's like smallest to like largest? So, the uh, let's see one. Does it just go in this order? I don't know. So we'll do the little chin eye, whatever you would call that, and then the swirly, and then the right part of the eye, and then the eyebrow, and then the center, and then that part. I'm gonna give it a try. That, 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 that. Nothing happened. Great. Maybe it's the opposite order? Hmm. No, not quite. Oh. She might have dropped something? She might have dropped something, chat. What might she have dropped? She dropped something? She was over here. Did I pick up something that she dropped? Uh, hmm. Interesting. I don't, I don't see anything. Oh yeah, I don't know. Hmm. Uh, no clue. Okay, back to the column. There's gotta be a way. Oh, look, you can reset it. Maybe this tells us how. <laughs> Maybe. Can we translate it? No. I literally don't understand. Where the heck is something that she dropped? What she what would she have dropped? Like a notepad or something? Here. Oh. 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 Oh, I see. This. She, she didn't drop it, though. This. This is it. 16, 8, 4, 32. That's it. That's the code. 16, 8, 4, 32. So, 16, 8, 
432 or 32. So hearing, thought, sight, taste. Let's try it. Yeah, remember that number, guys. 168432. Let's get in her bag. It'll probably be the last thing that we can do, but it'll be the best thing. I went the wrong way. I can never remember which one her room is. Now! <laughs> ah. Perfect. Hello. I think I found a new area of the tomb. We're near running the main entrance. We're running. We're running out of options of distracting her. So, all right, sixteen. So little eye corner in the right part of the eye, um, eyebrow, pupil, and then swirly. That. Eyebrow, pupil, swirly. Oh, wait. Did I do it wrong? Well, it's 1 16th. I was assuming it's still the same. 16, 8, 4. What did I do wrong? Chad, what did I do wrong? Sixteen eight four thirty two. Sixteen eight four thirty two. Sixteen eight four thirty two. I did. Am I missing? Maybe I'm missing a number, another number. Oh, it's backwards? What do you mean? How do you, what do you mean it's backwards? 30, is it backwards? Hearing, thought, sight, taste. Yes. What do you mean it's backwards? How do you know it's backwards? The eye is facing the opposite direction. Oh! Jai! Oh my god, you're so smart! Yeah, it was facing backwards! Visitors from the sky. This girl and her dog believe in aliens. No better proof can be found for extraterrestrial life than the pyramids on the Giza Plateau. To stand at the base of this monumental structure is to be convinced that the Anunnaki helped construct the Great Pyramids of Egypt. Archaeologists who state that the pyramids were built using copper tools and a workforce of, workforce of 20,000 over only a few decades have been unable to substantiate their claims. Clearly, this is because man did not build the pyramids. This is much evidence to prove a more advanced race was behind their creation. Consider the following facts. The Great Pyramid is aligned with one-tenth of a degree to the North Pole. The stones are cut so precisely that a razor blade cannot fit between them. The positioning of the three main pyramids aligns with the three stars in the constellation Orion's Belt. How could a quasi-stone age culture have built the pyramids when it lacked advanced mathematics, tools, astronomy, Astrological, whatever, knowledge, I'm tired. Needed to accomplish the feat? The answer is simple. They couldn't. It was Anunnaki who provided the ancient Egypt Egyptians with this knowledge. Even more telling is the utter lack of documentation for a society that kept highly detailed records of both major events in daily life throughout its 3,000 year history. No mention of the pyramids construction has been found. There's no evidence. There is also no definitive proof that the pyramids ever acted as or was intended to act as burial chamber. Chambers. chambers. The true purpose of the pyramid is to act as landing markers for the Anunnaki's return, as well as being markers 
Early tests indicated that the granite slabs above the king's chamber and the Great Pyramid were capable of emanating an electric field. The field could act as a transmitter or receive for signals from space. With all the hard evidence, it is clear Egypt could soon see the return of the beings who gave them the pyramids. Okay. Why would an alien expert need an archaeology textbook? Yeah, odd. Secrets remain uh, successfully hidden. No suspicions yet. No suspicions yet. Has the group been here before? New site holds promise. Clearly belongs to a queen. Maybe her daughters are present as well. Lines of ancestry must be tracked. Sites to investigate. Nefertari. Oh, look at that. Something's up with her. What else does she have in her bag? She got some lipstick. I wonder Ooh. what these mean. Oh, we're gonna take it? Okay. <laughs> we're just gonna take the stuff in her bag? Okay. Alright. Alright, well, we went through her bag. Um. Can't check that. Check. There we go. Check. Alright. Um, let's save here. We need to do columns plus note. Fr no, plus note. I'll just say note. Hopefully I remember that. <laughs> Yoink mine now. I know, right?